I'm Steve for This Week With Cars, and today I'm back with my 1976 Datsun 280Z. When I first got this car from Kevin at Junkyard Digs, we got a lot of comments on his video and my first video that this car was a piece of junk, it should be trashed, it's way too far gone, and nothing can happen with it. Well, I think it's turning out pretty nice, and today it's time to take it to the next level. I've taken the car to its first rally cross on the street tires and today I want to fit a set of real rally tires and to do it right I'm also going to fit the correct rally wheels. It is really hard to get proper rally tires here in the United States especially in the sizes you need for a vintage car. So these are from MRF tires and in the rear I'm going to run 195 70R15s and these are in the soft compound. And in the front, I'm going to run a slightly shorter tire in 195-65R15, and these are medium compound. These are different sizes and different compounds because this is all I could track down here in the United States. The 195-65R15s is what I wanted to run, but when I ordered them, they said they had them in stock, and then they said they only had three, and they only came up with two of them. So I found this set here which is really close and I think it'll actually give it a nice looking stance, but unfortunately it is a different compound. But on a rear wheel drive car, the soft in the back and the medium in the front might work out just fine. These tires are not DOT approved and they are not street legal. They are also directional, so I will need to pay attention because all four of these tires have to go on a certain corner of the car. And I'm not going to mount proper rally tires without putting them on proper rally wheels. These wheels I got from Real Classic Z Wheels. And these are exact reproductions of the Works Datsun Rally Wheel. These are kind of like a charcoal or anthracite color. I think this is a beautiful looking wheel and this is completely correct for the way that the factory Nissan Rally cars ran. So I'll get all of these tires mounted up and then we can take them over to the car. These tires are really heavy. These sidewalls are very thick and these are noticeably heavier than a standard tire. There we go. One down, three to go. Wow, these wheels and tires look so cool. I think these are way better looking than what I have on the car right now. I think these new tires make these old ones look pretty pedestrian. So these rear tires are taller than the front. So if I hold up a front next to a rear, this is the difference in the total diameter. You can barely see a difference there. And of course this is the diameter, so the height difference on the actual car is only going to be half of this. I'll get these on the car and then we can see what they look like. I have one side on. I don't know if the camera picks it up like I see it in person, but these new tires look fantastic. A lot more aggressive than the old ones. here it is. I think this looks awesome. These wheels look perfect. There are a couple more modifications that are on this car that were on it during my last rally run, but I never talked about them. I do have a 240Z bumper on the front now. And I also have the 240Z bumper on the rear, as well as these really cool Datsun mud flaps. These are, I think, are from a Datsun 710 pickup truck. These are original. I could not find any reproductions anywhere. And on the inside, I installed a roll bar. It has an integrated harness bar on it, as well as an integrated strut brace. My friend Nick built this cage for me and he did an awesome job. This thing is just absolutely against the ceiling. He actually did computer 3D scans of the interior of this car. 
and he bent and cut all these bars based on what the computer said. He didn't grab any ta tape measure and measure anything inside here, and it came out amazing. I think we should take it for a drive, see how these tires handle the asphalt. Just removing around the parking lot here. Doesn't seem any different. Maybe a little squishier. The tires seem fine. They don't seem any different than any other tire. I thought they might make a lot of noise, but it's nothing excessive, especially not for an off-road tire. I took that corner a little fast, no squealing from them. On the tarmac, these tires are just fine. So I'm pretty excited for the next rally cross. I think it's coming up. Looks like for some reason my voltmeter has stopped working, but that's probably the least important of the gauges. The tack and speedometer are still working. I should fix my emergency brake switch sometime or permanently disable that light in some way. And that's going to be it for today. I'm pretty excited to take this to the next rally cross. If you want to see more videos on my Datsun 280Z, comment below and click subscribe.